One, two, three. Live from Connecticut. It's Saturday night. Just kidding. This is the Kenny Hill Show. Um, I just recently saw the Saturday Night Live movie, and it is unbelievable. Definitely go see it. Um, I was actually on this man's show. Uh, they had me call in and ask a few questions. This is Brian Shapiro from Pushing the Limits. So without further ado, it's actually Saturday morning. But this is the Kenny Hill Show. I'm Ken, live from Connecticut. So here's Brian Shapiro with Pushing the Limits. Two, eight, three. Let's go to Ken. Ken is first up on PTL. What's up, Ken? Hey. Ryan, hey, it's Ken from Connecticut. Nice to meet you. Hey, what's up, Ken? How you doing? Um, a couple of things. First yep. of all, um, Brian, uh, Patrick Bet Davis, you should go on him because a couple of the other um, um, internet guys are on there. Pat, man, and, and Neil deGrasse Tyson was on there. Maybe yeah, I wouldn't be as nice. I, I like uh, Pac-Man, yeah. by the way, but I wouldn't be as nice as them. I think uh, David is a racist would, bigot. He's a bigot. You would tear him to pieces. Yeah, he's an imbecile. I mean, he just, he's, he's, a, he's a complete imbecile who sits on his ass there and coddles Donald Trump. And he tries to, you know, there's a difference between trying to get people going in an interview and actually. We don't like to coddle Donald Trump. He has enough coddling, just for the record. Back to Brian Shapiro. Being factually accurate, I think there's a way to do that mm. by being factually accurate. I think Bet David is another one of these right-wing clowns that only cares about clicks. That's all he cares about. So here's my advice. Here's my advice, and you can tell me whether you disagree or not. I don't think any of us should be looking at any polls. We all have to assume, let's all assume that it's going to be a very close contest. It's going to be very close this election. Let's not be worried about any polls. Let's, right. let, let's let Kamala Harris keep doing what she's doing. She's campaigning hard, doing a better job than Hillary did, by the way. She is in those battleground states, and she's working hard. And we need to work hard as well and spread the word and continue to talk to people and make sure we vote and get as many people as possible to vote against Orange Man. Right? I mean, we can't, we can't look at any poll. Yeah, yeah. This is where Brian Shapiro asks me about... Well, I asked him about uh, Brett Baer, the, the, um, the Fox interview with Kamala Harris. And I had something to say about that. So back to uh, Brian Shapiro pushing the limits and the Ken Hill show. Um, Brett Baer was definitely lying. Yeah. He should be demoted to doing uh, either traffic or weather for pushing the limits. That's my <laughs> Well. Well, he'll probably get a raise at Fox News, right? Uh, but but I, I, actually, I like that idea, Ken. <laughs> I like that. Let Brett Baer do the weather for me on, on PTL. What will what I do? I'll, I'll pay him in, like, fries and burgers. I'll, I'll pay him with food. <laughs> That's what I'll do. 702-221-72. Well, that was my interview with uh, Brian Shapiro. We were calling back and forth from the studio in uh, Norwalk, Connecticut. Out to, his show is in Las Vegas. Nevada, so he was at a couple of events out there, and um, so there you go, there you have it, live from Connecticut, the Kenny Hill Show, thank you everybody, see you soon, bye now, thanks.